Late Night Health continues. I'm Mark Allen along with the insane Daryl Wayne. He's, he's been pretty sane today. Thank you. You really haven't asked me anything. So. Oh, have I ignored you? No, not necessarily. Okay. Well, afterwards, you'll tell me something crazy. All right, anyway. Uh, we are talking about uh, radical metabolism right now. And uh, in about uh, 10 minutes, we'll be uh, joined by Elizabeth Kelly. She's an attorney, a criminal defense attorney, primarily for those who are mentally challenged and disabled. Uh, we were talking about uh, uh, Sebia. There have been, as you mentioned, studies on Sebia. It doesn't affect blood sugar. It doesn't cause spikes. It doesn't cause up, down, sideways. There's just one problem with Sebia to me, uh, uh, Anne Louise, the taste. I can't stand it. You, you haven't been using the right stevia. There is a brand that includes FOS. It's fructooligosaccharides, which are natural sugars from fruits and vegetables. And if you just use that stevia, you will find no aftertaste. I couldn't write about something that has a, a nasty taste. So this is the only kind that I suggest. But isn't cane sugar a natural product, and we just should use it in limitation? Well, if we could use it in limitation, like not more than two teaspoons a day, we'd probably be okay, but it's hidden in so many products. It's just too much of a white thing, so to Got speak. Got it. Got it. And it's a lot of it is not GMO, is is genetically modified now. Oh, it, it most definitely is. Right. Uh, the uh, We talked about gut health, and we talked about uh, uh, the fact that gut health, if you fix that, you can... You, you can fix a lot of other ailments. One of the things that uh, uh, people do is they, they juice, they, they do cleanses. Do you believe in those kinds of things for, say, a week or two, and then you can go back on, on food? Uh, we do a cleanse. It's a four-day cleanse to kind of tune up the system. And it uses a soup, which is very healing and very good to get rid of uh, a lot of water retention, which is so prevalent with those of us over the age of 40 in this day and time. So, yeah, I think people need quick motivation, Mark. If you don't see instant results, people don't stay on a program. So I include that in what I call a four-day intensive cleanse, which utilizes a couple of juices and a special soup made with watercress, which is very detoxifying and gets rid of a lot of water weight and actually tastes very good. And, and again, I eat, I was a restaurant critic for years, and I love eating. I, I just, I like food. I like to try ethnic foods. I like to try all kinds of foods. And, 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 and my, my taste buds prefer not sweet, but non-sweet foods mm -hmm. and so I try to eat those and then maybe take a little bit of sweet at the end my point is that don't most of us eat for taste or or not we just eat to eat no no there are many people that are involved with health that eat for taste and eat for health and I think you can combine the two which is what we've tried to do with our recipes there are lots of um, cuisines that show a lot of variety. They're ethnic cuisines, whether it's Indian, Thai, Mexican, Italian, uh, Greek. So we try to include all of those healing spices, which are so important, from curry to turmeric to oregano to dill to cumin. Very, very important in terms of being a cancer fighter. So, I mean, I think there's a lot of ways to skin the cat. And if you're not a juicer, then you would simply skip the four-day radical intensive cleanse and go right to the 21-day reboot. And, and in the, with the juicing, how do you, what kind of juices are you recommending? Well, we're recommending mostly vegetable juices. We're actually juicing a grapefruit, a little bit of apple. We're, we're juicing a jicama, some lettuce. I mean, some really interesting things that actually taste very good. We did this with a support group, and women and some of our men lost up to 10 pounds in four days. And if you want quick results because you haven't been able to lose weight on any other keto or paleo plan, that's pretty radical. Uh, you spent years with the Pritikin Institute. You betcha. I was the first director of nutrition on the no fat high complex carbohydrate diet model that was taking over the country in the 80s. And do you still believe that that's the way to go? No, that's why I got out of the Pritikin Center. I don't. 
I think the right fats are the way to go. We, we need a fat-fueled metabolism for the mitochondria, the cell membranes, the health of our brain, the health of our joints, our heart, our nervous system, and not enough fats is what is killing America. But we've got to make those the right fats, the essential fats, a little bit of omega-3s, 6s, 7s, 9s, and some coconut oil. And uh, uh, I want to cook with uh, avocado oil. Yay! Is that good? Mm-hmm. You know, what about... It's very stable. And, and I think it has a high flash point, too. Uh, it sure does. We use avocado oil. We use ghee, which I'm sure you're aware of. What is that? Ghee. It's oh, ghee, butter. yes. Clarified butter, yes. And uh, uh, that that's something... It tastes good, too. It sure tastes good. That's why radical metabolism is so radical. It tastes health, and detox. Well, we really appreciate your spending some time with us. The name of the book is uh, Radical Metabolism, and I, I did not say this, but uh, uh, Anne Louise has a, a a nickname, I guess the First Lady of Nutrition. <laughs> from Dr. Atkins, yes. From, the, from Dr. Uh, from Dr. Uh, Atkins, uh, and she's written 30 books, folks, but this is one, if you're over 40, you got to take a look at it, and I'll tell you what, I'm going to try it. I have some time, because uh, I'm by myself right now, uh, while my wife is uh, out, of the, uh, the, uh, out, of, out of the city, and uh, I'll try to make the soup and juice and report back in two weeks. Thank you. I'm dying to hear. I will have you back, and we'll know. All right. Uh, late <laughs> okay. Night Health continues. Don't go away. More coming up.